Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Paper Mario in the last episode. We beat Toot and Koopa, found out where the next star spirit is, and rescued the, the star spirit here. And in this episode, we are going to be heading back to Toad Town. However, not before we take care of something first. I was going to fight the bandit, but then I realized that's probably a dumb idea. Right, first off, I need to find the path. Back to... Whoop! Eh, gotcha! How, many, how much HP do these guys have? Five. Oh, you know what? Hold on. I want to use his move. Change member to Bombit. And then I'm going to use Bombit to Bombit. Boom! Bandits be gone! Oh, they gave two star points each. It's not bad. As long as I keep using Bombit. As long as I can Bombit. All right. There's the path, and I think it's back this way. I think it was closer to Mount Rugged than, uh, than to... There it is. So if I come over here and talk to Colorado... Well, what a luck. No clues about the ruins. Now I'm getting so frustrated, I might just have to give up the expedition for now. How very sad. I say, Mario, um, uh, that artifact you're holding in your hand? It looks like... It looks quite important. Do my eyes deceive me, or is this a clue to the dry, dry ruins? Mario, old chum, I beg of you, could you possibly part with it? Artifact, give it to Colorado. Cheers, Mario, smashing, really, old boy. Soon now the mysterious dry, dry ruins will rise from the sands that conceal them. As a brilliant archaeologist, I must say... I say it must be so. I suppose a thank you gift is in order, eh, old boy? Here you go, then. A star piece. You know a bit of magic. You of the desert? Cherish the memory, old boy. All right. And I Wait a minute. Do they have a magic lamp? <laughs> the mushroom genie shall come out and give them a, the, the, the way to the star. As opposed to just wishing for the star. And here we are back on Mount Rugged. However, for this, I think I'm going to need Goombario out again. You'll see why. If you recall on our way up here, we met somebody on the bridge. Somebody who, um... Somebody who had, uh... A wanted poster of us, would you... To, to say the least. Somebody who, if we were to cross paths again, might not be too happy with us. Hey there, hold up a sec, partner. Just a darn minute, I've seen you somewhere. Here he comes. The buzzard! What's he doing? Reaching under his feathers and pulling out. And look at those little eyebrows dance. Unless you're on a very low setting that you can't see that. Yep, very similar. You look a lot like this feller Mario who's on Bowser's Wanted poster. Now, Give, what's your name? Um, I'm Princess Peach. What's that? Princess Peach? You take me for a fool, Princess Peach is captured up there in Bowser's castle. You reckon I don't know that? You're asking for it, you big fibber. I'm thinking you're Mario. Prepare for for your whooping. All right, and here we have an optional mini boss. I don't know what his name is, but uh, surely Gumbario knows. This is Buzzer. He guards Mount Rugged. Wow, that's one big bird. Max HP is 40, attack power is 3, defense power is 0. If you get caught in the clench of his sharp claws, you lose 4 HP. Try to wriggle out of his grip. His special attack is to flap his wings and create wind. This attack damages your party members, too. But he was, uh, but what, uh, wait. But he was hatching eggs, wasn't he? Is it possible that he's really a she? I wonder. All right. So now, uh, do I have any items that could hurt him? <laughs> There's one damage, great. Uh, nope, nothing of the sort. So I guess I'm just gonna have to jump on him. Jump! Yeah, y'all. Mm hmm. All right, I only got it. I got it down to one hit. Sweet. All right. Um. I guess I'll keep using power jump. I'm really bad at power bounce, which is why I don't use that. All right, here he comes. Come on. Yeah, got away. The reason I saved this guy for now is because he's really hard to beat if I don't do it. If I do it, uh, when I first meet him, he's got 40 HP for God's sake. However, a lot of his attacks are pretty easy to avoid. There we go. Aha. I seem to be doing pretty well for myself here. Oh, I forgot to use power jump. 
Well, whatever. He's almost down to half anyway. In fact, now he's down to half. What's he going to do? He's going to try and pick me up. Uh, I don't think I'm going to... No, I didn't make this one. Four damage as he drops me from the sky. What a dick. All right, let's jump on him again. I, I need to conserve my FP. Goombario, go! Head bonk. Head bonk. Dang it. Oh, at least it only does two damage. Power bounce, jump, whatever. Power jump. Powerman. Head bonk. Bonk! Oh, shoot, I missed. I screwed it up. All right, come on. I should be fine. Oh! Four damage. He's got six health left, so... I think what I'm going to do is play it safe here. Uh-oh. All right, Goombario, you got to hit twice, otherwise I'm dead. There we go. Woo! That was a close one. Give me quite a few star points, too. A grand total of 15. Yeah, well, I got whooped! <laughs> As he just... J Did he commit suicide? Uh-oh. No, his eggs aren't going to be fertile. Or warm. You know, I don't even need uh, him for this. I can just go over here and be like, Boing! Spoing! Spoing! Let's see. I'm going to go back over this way. Actually, I should go back the other way, only because I need to find... A certain mole. Mole, 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 mole. Let's see. Is he over here? Well, those are Monty moles. Those aren't the moles I'm looking for. Whoop! Oh no! I didn't want to save you. I didn't want to say goes wrong. And now I can't use the footage. And now again. All right. Well, what is the grace of God? Something won't go wrong. Eh. All right. Um. I think it's... Is Wacka over here? Yep. Wacko! I'm Wacka! Just another picture-perfect day atop Mount Rugged! Oh man! Ow! Wacko! Don't hit me! Wacka's bump! Oh god. It's the most morbid thing to think that I eat Wacka's bump. And that is a, it is a valuable resource. Valuable resource. Valuable resource as we go on through. And heal! Oh, thank you. Thank you ever so much. Something over here, I can feel it. Level up! Uh, which party member do I want to upgrade? Paracarry. I will upgrade Paracarry. Yes. Because Paracarry, his, um, his move, his, uh, his secondary move is very useful. I can't remember what it was called. The one where he tucks inside of his shell and launches himself at people. Really useful. Yeah, super useful. I can't think of anything more useful than that. Anywho. We gonna get on the train. Hello, sir! This is the train bound for Toe Town Station! Are you coming aboard? Yes, I am coming aboard. Never talk again. Alright. All aboard for Toad Town! Oh man, we get to ride inside the cab of the train. There's no cars or anything. I don't know why they didn't do that. It seems like the least convenient train ride ever. I like how the smoke is stars. Aw, oh, it's like Chuffy from Banjo Tooie. Except. Yeah, no, Chuffy had a car in him, too. Come on, let's go. <laughs> I don't know what the point of watching that whole thing was. I, c I probably could have skipped it. Wait, but how is the Chuffy going to turn around? Toad Town! Toad Town! Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you for screaming in my ear the way you do. The way I like that you do. You do that do that you do. Uh, I think, I think I need, like, a game card here, but I can't get one yet. Alright, let's see. Let's see what's at the bad shop. That's not the bad shop. That is the sewers. Which is private. Also, I've got a sneeze. Oh, God. Okay, come on. Also, where's Twink? 
I figured he'd come and tell me something about these, uh, these people. Uh, don't make eye contact with it. I'd figure, like, <gasps> Chuck Quizmo! Quiz! It's everyone's favorite quiz master, Chuck Quizmo! Wanna try the quiz? Yes. Yes, Chuck Quizmo, yes. Then let's go to the quiz! Question, whatever. Question! What ability does Gumbario frequently use? I'd be Tattle. Ding dong! Correct! Congratulations! Here's your star piece. Got the star piece. You correctly answered three questions so far. Good luck next time. Well, well, so long. Farewell till we meet again. Goodbye, Chuck Quizmo. I'm sorry I portray you as some kind of racist stereotype. What do you have to say? Oh, hi, Mario. Thanks for coming to visit me. It's so quiet around here. I've really been bored. I know I just moved here, but I kind of wish some, some, I moved somewhere more happening. It's so quiet, it's actually kind of unsettling. I miss all the hustle and bustle that was here uh, when we first moved in. <laughs> Do you mean when, when Peach was kidnapped? Because I can imagine how that'd be more exciting. Also, what's in here? Huh. Huh. Interesting. That building is a lot longer than just that room, and there's no back to it. So I'm a bit confused. A little confused, if it were. Tiny Toads! Playing in a field! Alright, where does Twink come in to, like, actually give me the advice that he said he'd have for me? I gotta go over here? Ah! Just now a ghost passed right in front of me! Uh, you saw it, didn't you? I saw it. I, I'm not the only one! Over there! Hmm? No, it's the other way! Hmm? It went into the forest! Hmm? M Mario! This man is attempting on the forest to see what's going on! I'm ashamed to say my job, I can't just go and be friend and too scared of ghosts! P please, I'm begging you! Oh, you silly. There's no reason to be afraid of ghosts. Especially not one that looks like a butler. Gerard Butler, as it were. Oh, man. See, nothing to be afraid of. These woods aren't... Spooky. Hmm? Pardon me, sir. Would you happen to be Mario? How do you do, sir? My master wishes to see you. If you would please call us at the, uh, at the mansion on the far side of the Forever Forest. My master would also like to see that uh, that she had uh, that she has in her possession important news regarding the star spirits. Please make haste. We shall await your arrival with a warm welcome. And if you don't come, we'll get you! Boo! Hmm. Well... I do believe I know where I'm going next. Chapter 3! The Invincible Tubba Blubba. Oh, man. It's so dark and scary in here. Forever Forest is in both directions. Toad Town's back that way. So there's a way you can tell which way you have to go in this forest. Or when you pass by certain things, they'll do things like that. And that'll tell you which way to go. Hmm? Hmm? What do you think you're doing here? This is the Forever Forest. The path ahead is extremely dangerous. Didn't you know that? You better go back. What? Come on! Um, okay, so that's your story. You're invited to Boo's Mansion. You may pass, then. Listen carefully. If you want to get through this forest, you'll have to pay real close attention to your surroundings. If you choose the wrong paths, you'll end up at the forest edge before you know it. There are areas around the correct paths that look slightly different from the others. Watch carefully for clues. For example, in this area, take a good look at the inner trees as you walk around. In one of them, you'll have to spot strange glowing eyes. The exit uh, near that tree is the path you want to take. These clues will be different in other parts of the forest. Watch the inner forest very carefully as you go. Well, I'm gonna go have a sandwich. He looked like a hobo. I give him a hobo voice. Let's see. The inner part of the forest, huh? 
Whoop! Green fuzzy! These are new enemies. So I believe I'm gonna wanna change members back to, I should probably should have had Goombario out this entire time. Uh, let's go ahead and tattle on the forest fuzzy. This is a forest fuzzy. Forest fuzzies are always green. Max HP is six, attack power one, defense is zero. If they grab hold of you, they'll absorb your HP and add to their own. The fiends, those no good. Oh, and they also divide. If they, div if they divide, they become even stronger. So try to beat them before they can split. Nope, too early. Come on. There we go. All right. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and use my hammer on this one. Beep! Hammer! Smash it with a hammer! Woo! If it's new enemies or enemies I haven't beaten, then I'll switch. Then I'll... Whatever. There we go. Oh, I'm doing good. The uh, the split thing is a move. It's not like when I hit them, they split, which would... That'd be nightmarish, actually. All right, let's go. Woo! Forest Fuzzy is dead. All right. It says, watch the inner forest. There we go. Whoop. Yeah. Ah, oh, dang it. And that's what it looks like when they clone themselves. All right, and I think that's about stopping time. So next time on Paper Mario, we're gonna continue through our way through the Forever Forest. Hopefully, find out about that star spirit. See you all then. Mario, closing words? Mario, don't look now, but I think I saw eyes shining deep in the hole in that tree. Th thanks, Mario.